Hey guys, this is Balu from Balu Prime and once again welcome you all back for an exciting tutorial. In this tutorial, I will show you how we can create this skateboard animation in Blender using constraints easily. So hope you guys will find this tutorial also but before going to that, if you end up liking this video, please click on that like button to share this content and if you are new to this channel, consider subscribing my channel and support me. And by the way, if you like short 3D simulation videos, you can check out my second channel, link in the description, okay? So now without any further ado, let's start today's video. So here you can see I'm using Blender 3.0, nice. So now let's set it everything in this default scene by pressing A on the keyboard and delete. So first of all, let's import our character along with skateboard animation. So go to this file, import, it is an FBX file. So select this FBX and locate your file where you have downloaded. And by the way, if you want to learn how we can download the characters along with the animations, you can check out link in the description or you can click on the I card above. So here you can see we got the animation. So let me increase the scaling. So in order to increase the scaling, we need to select the armature, press S and increase the scaling here. Okay. If I expand this, you can see the keyframes. So now I will set the time frame to 79 frames only. So now if I play this, you can see we got this animation here. So here we don't have skateboard. We have to attach that skateboard to the character. So now let's import skateboard model. So here I got this model from Sketchfab, download link in the description. So go to this file, import, it is an FBX file. So select this FBX and select the file and import FBX. So we got the model here. So here the model is of different objects. So we need to have all these objects as single objects. So select all the objects here, press Ctrl plus J to join them. So now this is a single object. So now let me select this move tool and let me set this origin point to geometry okay so let me rotate this skateboard so press 7 for top view hold control key and reduce the scaling now so i think this much of scaling is enough i think so press 3 for side view and we are on first frame now so being on the first frame place the skateboard so i think yeah, this is good to press one for front view and let me place this skateboard here okay nice so now let's see how we can attach this skateboard to this character so for that we need to select this armature let me come to this object properties viewport display and enable this in front option okay so that we can see armature here so here i want to attach this skateboard to this feet so we need to select this bone so let me select this armature, go to this here and select this pose mode. First, let's say the name of this bone. So select this bone. So here you can see this is Mixam or Rig1 left foot. So remember the name. So now let's move back to this object mode. Nice. So now select the skateboard, come to this constraint properties, add object constraint and add this child of constraint. So in target, we need to select the armature of the character. So select this armature and in bone, we need to select this left foot bone so let me search that bone here so here you can see we got that bone so here you can see the skateboard is not in the position where we have set so simply click on the set inverse it will be back in its position so now if i play this you can see we got the animation here but we are finding a bit issue so at the starting frames you can see the skateboard is not straight now we need to adjust this manually so we want the scaling sorry rotation to be like this so beyond the frame where the rotation is completed so at this frame we want this to be here so select the board press i on the keyboard and add a keyframe for location and rotation so now move to the starting frame now let me rotate this once again so select this and rotate this here press i and add a keyframe for location and rotation so now we can see we got bit movement here so we need to adjust this one so beyond that frame let me adjust this here a bit so press i and now if i play this we can see here also we got some bit rotation so at this point let me add a keyframe okay So now if I play this, we can see we got that perfect. Nice. So here also we need to adjust the rotation. So finally, let me hide out this armature. Okay. And let me enable this cavity and shadow. 
and let's add a ground plane press i okay fine press 3 for side view and let me place the plane just here nice okay fine so in this way we can create the skateboard animation in blender using constraints easily so hope you guys have learned something new from this tutorial if you have learned anything new please like share and subscribe my channel to support me so we'll meet in the next video until then signing off take care bye